Hello and welcome to the JBNM Sports Fanatic channel. Thank you for joining me for this video. And my man, Dak Prescott, he is making money moves here. He is leaving Adidas and signing a five-year agreement with the Jordan brand. And so Prescott will be the only Jordan brand quarterback and only Cowboys player and the highest paid NFL player on a Jordan brand roster. This is coming from the same quarterback that finally got the money, the extension he was looking for with the Cowboys with the four years, 160 million, but the 40 million per year. And I believe $66,000 signing bonus. And so Dak Prescott's making money, you know, so all of these, all of this money means one thing. The expectation is going to be insurmountable for Dak Prescott for sure. So he's going to have to go out there and prove that, you know, this deal that he's got, that he um, deserves it on and off the um, off the field as well and not only that i mean recovering from that ankle injury in which we all saw it we felt so bad for him because you know dak has been waiting for that new contract for oh so long and then he ended up getting injured you know with that ankle injury but it seems like the injury he's trying to put behind him you know and it seems like you know he'd be ready to go he's moving well and so you know he's out there you know i'm um, looking like he's ready for the season and so he should have you know little to no issues with that ankle this upcoming season and so that is great for a player who's pretty much been durable with the exception of last season and so and some of the stuff that he's been able to do throughout his career you know that is fantastic you know expect especially since when he got drafted out of mississippi state there wasn't that many high expectations now last year before he got hurt he threw nine touchdowns to four interceptions you know a little less than um and he was two and three as a starter last year but overall in terms of his entire career you have to love what you've seen from 106 passing touchdowns to just 40 interceptions you know, he took over as a rookie and he immediately hit the ground running, you know, with 23 touchdowns to four interceptions. You know, so Dak Prescott, you know, 2019, his last full season, he threw for just shy of 5,000 passing yards, 30 passing touchdowns to just 11 interceptions. And so they're going to need for Dak Prescott to go out there and become a quarterback that can probably get them about, say, 40 passing touchdowns and keep that interceptions to about where it's been at or maybe even a little less. You know, he's going to have to definitely, you know, help this defense, in which they've made a lot. They spent a lot of the draft to help improve that defense, to give him some help out there. And so we'll see how it all comes together. New defense coordinator Dan Quinn coming over from the Falcons. We know what he did with the Seattle Seahawks. So all of that's coming together. But, hey, I tell you what's coming together really nicely for Dak Prescott. Whatever happens, win or lose, this man's getting paid. That is for sure. And so you got to appreciate when a man's out there, you know, getting banked the way he's getting banked. So you're going to see a lot of smiles from Dak Prescott, you know, up until the season starts. And so, yeah, but with that being said, thank you so much for joining me for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. And as always, as more news continues to break, you can be sure to find it here. So thanks again for watching and see you guys.